Hello everyone and welcome to Driven Mad. Now in the past you've seen us test what we tested, the T-Cross and oh, Panda 4 before. As far as just testing the braking systems and obviously we've got the Mini now, we've never tested it. Nope. It's a quiet day, it's it a is. holiday here in Portugal so the estate's quiet so we can use the road. So we thought we would bring old uh, big boy back out. Old hunky here. Hunky, yeah. Yep. And um, let's smash the Mini into him. Yep, let's see if the emergency braking is actually that effective because if we go back in time, the Panda was link, really good. Link, link. Panda, excellent. T-Cross, fail. So Every we're gonna, time. We're going to see if it might be the dummy's fault or if it's just well, it, the We always said it rubbish. can't be because the Panda was successful. Very true. So let's get in the Mini and crack on. And let's go and smash him up. Right, so inside the Mini, you can see we've got the safety button here. Now, I didn't really realise what this did, but when I was driving around Lisbon and people were jumping out at crossings with me, I thought, well, let's just see if this is any safety systems. Now, when you press it, you can see you've got collision warning and pedestrian alert. So we're going to flick on the pedestrian alert because, of course, we want that on. It's a great little car, this. It's boiling, isn't it? This is, I just said this is hot as it gets. Yeah, this is uh, very, very hot at the moment out here in Portugal. It's suddenly sort of cranked it up to mid 30s. And it's only 10, 10 in the morning. So let's, let's go smash him let's up. Let's go smash him up. Before you run off and get too excited and flatten him, how's this test going to work? We're going to do 10 kilometers an hour, 20? 10 was no, 10 was no good, was it? Should we, oh, we're going straight in with 20 then, are we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do 20 and then if it works, 30, I suppose. So. You get the pleasure. Come around that corner and give him a little smack. That didn't work, did it? What happened there then? That was a fail. I did the stopping. Yeah, you did the stopping. He hit, then I braked. Okay. Right, whilst Dad goes around the block just to make sure everything's uh, sort of calibrated, I don't know what, we don't really know what we're doing here, but he's just driving it around to sort of reset it. I've put you on a tripod because I need to hold the man in place and I'm going to have to jump out the way when he gets close. I did it. I was holding the guy, as you saw, I was holding him in place. Now I don't know whether the Mini recognised me as a person this time because I was so close and didn't jump, or maybe it just worked better now he's done a lap. We're going to do another try. Okay, so 20 kilometers an hour is definitely the sweet spot at the moment. Uh, now Dad's gonna go around at 25 and see what that does. Right then, so driver's perspective, let's wander around the block. 20's been successful, but 25 it shuts off. I'm not gonna touch the brake. So 25-ish. Oh, did it that time. So. I'm going to go through and check everything's on as well. Off, on, everything's on. So we're going to go around and give it a go. See, is bud. How you think he was six? And floor it. This thing's like, I have a really fast electric remote control car, and that's what this thing's like. So what we'll do is sit at twenty-ish. With Marie Jenning, it's not so easy. Right, here we go. So, we're gonna pull up to him here. We think it's because of the person standing next to the dummy. If you go back and I'll let go, you yeah. see it'll hit it, it's doing it me. Okay, let's, let's try that. Let's do this again at 20. Dad's gonna run. And he's right. You're right. Okay, so that concludes the video. I do apologise about you watching me and Dad right now in time lapse, drinking coffee and messing around. We left the camera in time lapse mode instead of video mode. So that's the one thing we learned is that we're a couple of idiots. But the mini system is fantastic in real life scenarios. It stopped every time when we were close enough to get hit. It didn't like our inflatable dummy, but every time me or Dad were close enough to the car, it stopped perfectly. So I can't really fault the system on that front. And especially driving around the town, cities it's a fantastic feature to have and it could be the difference between you hitting someone or not so it's fantastic for that 
Now, let us know what you want us to do in the comments below. We've got a Volkswagen T-Cross which we think we're going to test. We've done it once before, but we think we're going to test that safety system again to see if it can compete with the Mini. So stay tuned, please like, comment and subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.